It is not every day that I'm sitting down for a video, so it's kind of nice to have this for a change, to be honest. And you don't have to tell me I look like a vampire. I just decided to throw on some red lipstick and I'm feeling all right about it. Wow, it really does define my lips for sure. All right, small YouTuber time, let's go. So Kyler was awesome enough to mention me in his small YouTuber tag and he basically tagged me to do this thing so that's why I am here to talk to you guys. Trusty Galaxy S5 phone here with an awesome case, check it out, I got it on Amazon. I have it plugged in because I took a nap and I woke up from the nap and my phone is at 1%. All right, enough chitter chatter. Let's get started into the questions, shall we? What inspired you to start making videos? Honestly, I've been doing videos since I was in like fifth grade and it was before I discovered YouTube and I started uploading them on Google Video and that was before Google you know, took over YouTube and all that stuff. So yeah, I was a, a Google Video person for a while until YouTube uh, came around a year or two later. And then I started uploading on there. And I wanted to do videos because I thought they were fun to do. I was interested in it. And I didn't really start taking it seriously until like my freshman, blah, 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 I cannot talk. I didn't start taking it seriously until like my freshman year of high school when my video teacher was like, hey, you have a lot of potential. You should, you should make more stuff. And then I was like, hey, I really like doing this. Let's do a career out of it because that's fun. How long have you been on YouTube and have you had other channels? I've been on YouTube for eight years now. Holy crap, eight years. Uh, I started in 2007 in January. It was like brand spanking new pretty much. And yes, I did have other channels. I did not always have this one. That would be insane if I always had this one since I was 12 years old. That's crazy. Uh, lots of smiles, 12. Um, Emily Exceptional, and now this one. Um, I deleted my first one because I just kind of wanted to start fresh. I was like 12 years old in all those videos, and they weren't the best, but they, they were pretty funny for me. Then I had Emily Exceptional. I had a lot of vlogs on there, and then that got hacked, but that is a whole other story. Now I have this one, and I made this, uh, after the other one got hacked, so. Where do you see yourself and your YouTube channel in five years? I want to do film as a career, so I'm going to a community college in Portland, where I live, obviously, and I want to get my associate's degree. Is that when you do two years of college? I am so stupid, oh my god. And hopefully my channel, you know, has grown a little bit more and it's a, a lot better than it is now. But most importantly, I just want to be happy with where I am and what I'm doing. I think that's the most important thing. What message are you trying to get across with your videos? Honestly, uh, my videos are really inconsistent with content and posting. <laughs> Um, it's really bad because, you know, I do have a life outside of YouTube and stuff, and I have priorities. Um, if YouTube was my job, that would be a totally different thing. Uh, I would be posting a lot more, but currently YouTube is not my job. I don't make any money from it, really, so. Um, basically, I really, my main goal is just to make people laugh. Um, I try to make funny videos. Um, some of them aren't funny, some of them are. Um, I make advice videos, I make vlogs, I make um, skits, kind of like my last one that I posted. Uh, I don't really have a straight up message that I'm trying to convey. Basically, I just want to make people laugh. That's all I care about. Do people from school find your channel? Yeah, when I was in middle school and high school, people found my channel because, uh, you know, back when MySpace was super cool, I would post my videos, uh, the links to my videos on there, and people would watch them, people would come up to me at school and be like, oh my god, Emily, that video was so funny that you did, oh my god. And then in high school, um, you know, Facebook started becoming popular and Twitter and stuff, and I would obviously post on there, and I would talk about it with people in class, and also I did video announcements for my school all four years. So, that's how people found me. 
What does your username mean? Actually, my default uh, name on YouTube right now is Emily Olsh. Um, it's just really simple, my full name, um, first and last, that I was blessed with. Okay, maybe not blessed because Olsh sounds like you're stepping in mud with a boot. It's German, if you were curious. I'm, I'm half German. Basically what my channel name is, Emily Olsh X5, how I like to pronounce it, Emily Olsh times 5. Emily Olsh uh, is in there obviously because that's my name. Um, I couldn't have it just be that like I wanted because it was taken. So I added an X5. I kind of just threw the X in there, just, I don't know. And then five is my favorite number because I was born in 1995. I was born on the fifth month of the year. And also I'm the fifth child of my family. And I'm the last, so, yeah. Your favorite small YouTuber. Recently come in contact with a few awesome people um, just because of posting my less than famous audition uh, video a few months, was it a month ago? Two months? I don't know. You know, as outgoing as I am, honestly, I'm not the first person to engage in conversation. I usually like to be approached because feel awkward, I don't know what to say to people if they don't know me. So, you know, after I posted that video, I got a, a few views and stuff, and then these people were basically like, hey, I really like your videos, you have really good potential, we should talk. What's the Twitter? What's the Twitter? So then I connected with them, and I talked to them on a daily basis now, and here are a couple of those. I think they all make really good videos. I really like their content and I really like them as people and I'm just super happy to have friends to look forward to at VidCon this year. <laughs> Alright, I hope you enjoyed this video. I know it was probably kind of boring to watch but I honestly just don't like doing tags because I feel like that's for people with you know much bigger audiences and people who actually care about my personal life. Um, I don't have that many people that watch my videos so. And my thing's about to run out so I'm gonna put my links here, my at name, at Emily Olsh, Twitter, Instagram, and that'll be links in the down bar. Alright. Cool.